last rail session, probably my last rail session of 2023. Uh, check it out, we've got the sun, if you can see the express over there, I might be able to get it to focus. Yeah, the sun's sort of going down, so it's a nice sunset evening sort of thing going on. Uh, I've just been warming up, doing a few uh, tricks on the on the curb there just to get going. I did wax it as well, and yeah, we've got the old faithful rail here, waxed up too. I'm going to put it across the curb, and yeah, I'm just going to film. I've got no particular goals. One, my name's Amputee Adele. I'm a 36 year old, almost a 37 year old amputee, relearning to skateboard with two crutches, one leg. Maximum effort. I'm listening to body count, but yeah, it gets me pumped ever since I found him like a few months ago. I don't know, I believe that it's taken my whole life to find out body count, but yeah, absolutely sick. They're really, really cool. But yeah, I'm getting in the mood for dancing. We've got a nice sunset, we've got moon in the sky up there. Come on, guys, if you haven't already, we're going for the big 5 0, the 500, and the 1000 as well. Uh, yeah, wouldn't it be cool if we got this channel monetized at some point? That would be pretty sick. Uh, anyway, worry less, skate more, let's skate more, let's hold glass, skate more, a little less conversation, a little more action. Let's get it, let's send it. Yeah, let's send it. <laughs>
Quickly losing the light, quickly losing the wheel to lift. No, well, Bond's quickly losing the wheel to lift due to the fact that I keep landing on it. I keep going, slipping out. So I'm trying to actually, probably not barely, but trying to ollie into these tricks. And yeah, it's, it's effectively like a down rail, but I really, really want to get into a 50-50. That's my ultimate goal here. Uh, I don't know if I can get anywhere near, but I'm going to have the last few goes at it before we've still got some light, etc. Bum completely gives up, but yeah, this rail section just to top up the year, and my arms look really weird. And I'm also having massive shoulder problems with that, I'll talk about that in a minute. Anyway, three, two, one, bam!
guys. The last session, our uh, last mail session of 2024, and uh, yeah, uh, I had sick time there. Unfortunately, uh, I did eat food my French quite a few times, uh, more than I'd want to, especially on the old cocktails. But uh, the one thing I found with rails is it's getting pretty regularly stay confident and because uh, I've been concentrating so much on like flatland stuff I kind of I don't know if it is, someone is in and get that kind of action there in it because I think the more you do it and the more it scares you the more it challenges you that comfort zone grows so every time you eat away at the edge of that you start to expand slightly and expand slightly and expand slightly and before you know it you're doing a board side down a rail and you haven't even thought about it you know so uh, I thoroughly recommend everybody get yourself a flat bar uh, I, don't, I can't comment on square rails because I don't own one, but uh, I went straight to round because I thought that was what people scared and uh, uh, it was quite hard breaking myself into the round rail, but yeah, I'm glad I did, especially with like board sides and stuff like that, but uh, I'm really looking forward to this year, 2024, uh, going to be working on trying to get into actual 50-50s on this rail. As you can see, I was trying to like a teeter-totter it, so get the front on and then try and bring the back next to it, but like, because I was going downhill because I've got it set on the angle like that, it was like sliding away from the shafts, but yeah, I did technically over wax it probably. That's another, another top tip guys, test your rail before you put wax on it, test your rail before you scale it, so give it a quick once over, especially if you've got like board rails like I have, because otherwise you eat like absolute turd like I did that first time there, I was not expecting the board to shoot out, but it's a good time to say thank you very much for watching, we're a less escape more, thank you every single one of you who supported me in 2023 and all the two three years before that we are yeah, so that currently 358 i hope by the time you see this video it will be even more so uh, yeah and that's only down to you guys who've been supporting me on this channel these two three years i think it's three years at the end of january so uh but yeah like skateboard has given me something that no other sport or activity has given and uh this year i hope to do a lot more skating with other people that really is my goal and um, breaking those call it uh again talking about comfort zones like when it comes to confidence especially like social confidence things like that like it's easy to let it shrink and get on top of you and i did that through lockdown so I told myself i was better off by myself actually in fact like, i just enjoyed it seemingly uh, and then when i had to like go back to socializing again i remember how hard it was and then, uh bigger bigger chill out skate store and all the shrewsbury skaters man shropshire shrewsbury lot uh, you have been absolutely sick this year, giving me so much uh, confidence and hope for myself uh, to be able to reach out and talk to you guys and meet other people in the area and actually said shred and escape. You know, there's a lot to come, there's so much more to come because I'm just actually literally opening the can. I'm just opening the can. We've barely got the lid off yet. So just imagine once we get the lid off what we're going to find. We're going to be like dropping into like birds and we're going to be doing all sorts of insane stuff because I've absolutely no limits on what I want to achieve. Whatever I achieve. I'll take that and level up to the next stage. I've not put any notes in or whatever. I'm just, we're just going for it for whatever. So, uh, but if you think you believe in me and you think I can do this, subscribe to me. Send send this channel. Uh, share this video to a few friends and enemies and see if you can get them on board as well. But yeah, I hope you've had an amazing 2023. Landing my first king flip, doing so much crazy stuff. Oh my god, big spins. Uh, just so much fun, learning to wall ride. I can't even think, there's so many tricks that we've learned, like the pressure flips and everything. Oh my god, there's so much. I don't even know where to start. Transition stuff, uh, all in up and down things, like trying to get onto this rail. How an amazing time, and I'm so glad you're able to join me for this journey. Uh, I look forward to 2024 because there's a whole lot more coming, so watch this space. I'm pretty going to be pulling it full of insane and awesome stuff. Uh, I'm going to be doing more two leg stuff. I'm going to be doing stuff with my prosthetic leg. I'm going to be doing uh, parkour training because that's my ninth thing. And I'm also uh, getting back into inline to see if we can inline skate with two legs. Let's see if we can get this piece. Uh, one glove. And if I've got this, you've got this. Also, break dancing, don't forget. Worry less, skate more. Uh, two bridges, one leg. Maritime effort. See you guys soon. I'm Petit Dell. Signing out. No amputees were harmed in the making of this video. Well, not much, actually quite a lot, but worry less. Don't worry, don't worry. Amputee Adele is just fine. I'm surviving just fine, but yeah, no amputees were harmed. Look at this, I'm in shorts and t-shirt and it's like December. I'm actually starting to get cold there, I know, because you can probably see my goosey bumps, look. After all, it is the end of the year. We are celebrating. Uh, put the dreads down even for you guys so you can see what redhead bot Amputee Adele looks like with her dreads down. So here I am standing on my leg. Got so much to be grateful for at the end of this year. Um, I've got a little piece of paper here uh, which I'm going to talk about in just a second. But yeah, um, I want to thank all you guys first before I talk about my rubbish because without you guys, uh, I don't know 
if I'd be standing where I was and I don't know if I'd achieve what I have this year. Um, so I want to say big up, thank you very much. Arigato uh, to you guys, uh, but he knew the viewers that helped bring my channel up to 358 subscribers. Cheers, Kenpai, Yachita, um, I can't think of any of the ones, so there you go. Mm. That's the apple really. Magnifique. <laughs> Magnifique, I can't even speak already. Anyway, if you haven't already, I'm oh, sorry, I almost left. <laughs>